Hey everyone, my name is Liam and welcome to this match preview and prediction for the match between Taylor Fritz and Jiri Lehechka on December 29th at the United Cup. Let's get into it. Looking at this matchup, it's sort of quite easy on paper, I'd say, to, to determine who you should think would win the match. You know, it's it's an experienced player against a relatively young player, new on the tour. You could say well, Jiri Lehechka, he's 21 years old, but in terms of his tennis career, he's still quite young. Uh, in terms of match play, you know, you could say... You know, the likes of Alcaraz and all these other young players are younger than Lehechka, but they've got so much more experience on the main tour than Lehechka has. Lehechka is a great player himself. He's, he's, he reached the, uh, the finals of the um, next gen finals last oh, this year and he's been he's been playing great. He lost he lost out in three sets to Brandon Nakashima for the title. But, you know, it was a great run overall to get to the finals of it. It's a, it's a good accomplishment and it sets him up nicely for 2023. But coming into this match against Taylor Fritz, it's it's sort of saying like, I'm a, I'm a young gun, I'm trying to play my best tennis, but I haven't played any sort of exhibition matches over the last few weeks, any sort of tournaments really. He, he, he last played about six weeks ago any professional match, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't say he's going to come into this tournament quite up to scratch as where he would need to be. Whilst, you know, you look at Taylor Fritz, he's been playing tournaments left, right and centre. He won the, he won the Daria, tennis, Daria Tennis Cup beating Medvedev. He, he's, he's been in great form. I, I think he, a couple of days ago, he played in Hong Kong against Cameron Norrie or something like that. So he's been keeping himself in shape and, and sort of getting, getting his ground strokes running and, and making sure everything's squeaked clean. So I think coming into this match, I don't see any sort of issue for Taylor Fritz winning it. The question is now, how many sets it depends because, you know, when you are such an underdog or you don't have as much to, to lose or to win, even coming into a match like Jiri Lehechka has, you might as well, you know, go for your shots and, and stuff like that. But I think, to be honest, with the, with the lack of playtime he's had in the last six weeks and the, the fact that he's still, you know, relatively new to the tour in terms of big matches and stuff like that, I would say Taylor Fritz should cruise through this match quite easily. I don't think Taylor Fritz really wants to start start his season on a very tight free setter against a guy who's ranked like 80th in the world compared to him who's a top 10 player basically. I don't think that's that's what he wants to be doing. So I think this is going to be a quite easy match to predict for you guys. Taylor Fritz in, in two sets to get a win. If you want more predictions from my expert writers, please visit tennissection.com and if you want the best bets every single day straight in your inbox from, your, from our writers, please visit tennissection.com forward slash premium.